Good morning and welcome back to Destiny Speaks, guys. Today is Wednesday. I hope that today finds you well, that you awoke this morning in your right mind with a song in your heart and a praise on your lips, just giving God the glory and the honor and the praise because he is great and he's greatly to be praised. Listen, I am so late this morning. It is pouring down rain and everything that could happen this morning did happen, but I just wanted to stop by here and just share a brief word with you. Last night at church, we've been, our bishop has been teaching on the power of the Holy Ghost, the power of the Holy Spirit, and I just got so excited. You know, we've been talking this week about making an effort, and we've been talking in weeks before that about pursuing what it is that God has called us to do, and so many of us are just, just, you know, standing still. We've got all all kinds of excuses as to why we can't do what it is that God has called us to do. But if you knew the power that was working on the inside of you, you wouldn't have any more excuses. The Bible says that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. It is Christ that has strengthened you. It is the power of the Holy Ghost. Listen, I just stopped by here to tell you this morning that you can do it. Whatever it is that you are desiring, desiring in your heart. The Bible says that the, that the Lord would give us the desires of our heart if we will delight ourselves in him. So if you are delighting yourself in the Lord, those desires that you feel in your heart, they're from God. They're desires that he has given you. You already have permission. You don't need to wait around for anything. You're waiting because you're in fear. You, you think you don't have enough education. You think you don't have enough money. You think you're not smart enough. You're not good enough. Listen, all of that is a lie from the enemy. And today I send it back to the pits of hell from which it came. I'm telling you, there is a power that's working in you. It is the same power that raised Jesus from the dead. Do you think that it could not help you start your business? Do you think it could not help you start your ministry? Whatever it is, write your book, whatever it is, that go back to school. Whatever it is that you want to do. The Bible says in the book of Ephesians 3.20, my bishop used it last night and it's one of my favorite scriptures. It says, now unto him who can do exceedingly, abundantly, above anything that you may think think are as according, according to the power that worketh in us. Listen, that's the power that's working in you. It's the power of the Holy Ghost. And there is nothing greater. There is no power greater than that power of the Holy Ghost. And that's the power that's on the inside of you. Listen, don't let anything stop you today. Move forward in the things of God. There is a power working on the inside of you that is unstoppable. Okay, there's no excuse. There's no excuse. There is nothing that can stand up to the power of the Holy Ghost. Move forward in the things of God today. Listen, I'm sorry it's short. I got to run so that I don't be wait for, late for work, but God bless you. I love you. Have a Holy Ghost filled day. Tell somebody about Jesus and call Call on the power that's working in you. Amen. Be blessed today.